So now that we got the scooter running all good, um, I got some parts on the way, but they're in the mail. Uh, the guy who was gonna send me the key ended up wanting to like not even ship it out until next Monday, so I mean, whatever. It's the only one I could find, so the fact that I can even find one is cool. I'm grateful for that. Um, today, we're gonna go ahead and take apart the brakes and give them a once over, because my wife's gonna be riding it. I wanna make sure everything's in good shape, so uh, we'll pull apart the brakes today and see how they look inside and clean them up and see if we can get them to work a little bit better. on this side. I'm gonna go ahead and loosen up these brakes. I don't know if I can get this brake caliper out. Uh, the brake shoes look like they're they're wearing down pretty evenly and there's also plenty of meat left on here so that's good <clears throat> so So I don't have any cotter pins uh, for that front wheel, so I'm just gonna take some uh, stainless steel welding rod that I have, and I'm just gonna go ahead and make one out of that. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, readjust these brakes and take a verse spin and uh, see how well it stops.
so we got the moped running. Um, basically, it's gonna be used as transportation for my wife to get to work. Um, so I actually wanna like, re not restore it, but take care of it properly. Um, you know, so it's safe to ride. So we'll end up getting new tires at some point. I have an air filter on the way for it, um, as well as some other things. So anyways, the, uh, so I did find out the scooter is called a, it's not a Yamaha Champ. It's called a QT50, or they got nicknamed the Yamaha Hopper. So it's called the QT50 by its technical name. So we've been calling it the QT50. Um, so anyways, <clears throat> so there'll be uh, some more work on it in the coming videos.